Hello and welcome. This application can show which keys are pressed. For example, if I control C and then control V, control, control V, control V, control V, control V, and it will show that on the right hand side here. It's in the system info bar down here. It's called Carmack. This doesn't really react. It's a Windows 10 application or 8. It's really weird, but kind of works. You can also select which monitor gets used for it. You can put it in either side and then Oh, it's still there. Okay, let me just uh, save this. Right, now it's at the top left. You can even have auto updates, but I'm not going to do that. And I'm going to put it back there, save, and back it is to the bottom right. Let's have an offset so it appears a bit further away. Uh, you always have to press the keys so it uh, so you can test it. So I recommend you go to appearance and set the delay to 50 or something. Well, the max value. And then you just um, can take your time configuring this. This has not been 50 seconds. <sighs> you can also increase this thing, make it more opaque. Can I make it even more opaque? Oh, there we go. And increase the font size. Why 48 the max? I don't know. Let me just uh, put it a bit bottom offset like this. So now it does this thing. Uh, unfortunately, you cannot center it, but that is fine. So you can just get it from KarnakKeys.com. It also has a GitHub where there's a release page and there you can just download the setup.exe. If you cannot you run an exe file on your computer, then, well, I have a download link in my uh, video description for you where you can just download a zip. And then there's KeyPose, which does this. It will show the key in the center of the uh, yeah, screen at the bottom. Clicking the notification icon will lead you to settings. Really weird. Oh no, settings don't work. So for now it just shows one, the last key used. It's nicer, it kind of looks nicer because it's in the center at the bottom. But oh well, not ideal. I think uh, Karnak will be the better one of these two. Make sure to give this video a like. Let me know in the comments if you found a better tool. Subscribe to this channel to support it. Until next time, ciao.